Hi, Neil. I'm Chef Tom. We are cooking. We're going to dice some onion, bell pepper. And then I got this two beautiful pack of the ground turkey. We're going to cook it. And we can use the tortilla wrap. Or you can just eat it like that with served with the rice. It's going to be so delicious and healthy. But first we have to cook the vegetable and the turkey separately. Because the turkey is cold, you know. So we don't want to uh, ruin the process of the cooking. So now I'm going to preheat the frying pan. I already did a couple minutes ago. So it should be nicely warm now. Some vegetable cooking oil. And then we're going to add the onion in. And I'm going to add some uh, garlic. A lot of garlic. Love garlic. Just going to give them a roughly chop, right? Maybe one more time. We're going to cook the garlic, caramelize a little bit. Get them very good flavor. Okay, bell pepper. Pop at the bottom. Juicy, crunchy, delicious. Like that. Red pepper. Some people call it sweet pepper. They can just like that, huh? Yeah. Give me boy, I'm shooting a video. Okay. Now here, or you can cut this way, diagonal, and then come across. Little trick, if you want to cut the bell pepper, this side actually, the layer of the skin are pretty tough. So I like to cut from the inside. Okay, here we go. Saute this vegetable cannot be rushed. We want to have great flavor. So it's going to take about a good 10-15 minutes. Stir. You see how beautiful, colorful? Yes? Some pepper, some Himalayan salt, ah, gorgeous, okay, I'm going to stir this for a while, I come back to you, smell amazing. Nicely warm. Okay, I'm gonna set this into a bowl. Not for too long. And then here, 
I'm just simply using a paper towel, wipe out all the juice and the oil, and make sure stay in the high heat. So this recipe you can cook with fajita, anything, you know? Almost like a fajita, taco. Okay, why the frying pan is still hot and smoking? Just a little bit of oil. Okay, make sure it's really hot now. Swirl it a bit. Make sure it's very hot. And now we're gonna add this natural ground turkey meat in. Now one more. You can cook this and you can have this for two or three meals, you know? Okay, now our ground meat is in, so we're just gonna gently break it apart. We want to make sure the frying pan is nice and hot, so it will like brown the turkey. More flavor, you know, like this. You see that? If your frying pan is hot on this side, rotate it every few minutes, so you got even heat. The idea is I want the heat to uh, sweat, caramelize the turkey, and I don't want a lot of juice show up in my frying pan. Just listen to the sound. Not undercook, and don't let the turkey burn too. Cook, baby, cook. Okay. Now it's good to have uh, something to drink, yeah? Okay, I'm gonna let them cook for one to two minutes. Slowly, it will start breaking apart. No rush. Take your time. I hope you guys start cooking with two spatula now, okay? If you got really talent, you can cook with three spatula. Okay, I'm gonna let them cook for another minute or two and come back. Looking great. Now we can break apart. Little lumps, okay. Just make sure not too big of the lump. Make sure the turkey meat cook through, right? Okay, so this one is good. Sometimes the turkey uh, in the cooler too long, they have water, you know, it's normal. So if you want to drain something out, you put a, like a paper towel here, okay? Paper towel here, you see that? And then you tip, you tip your frying pan and the paper towel absorb all the water or juice. Okay, now they're looking good. We're gonna add 
fact, still hot and warm. Got that? So now we're going to get them stir evenly. Ah, oh, smell amazing. Right? Onion, bell pepper, garlic, never go wrong. Okay, now we can season. A lot of black pepper. We're going to add some oyster sauce, huh? It's just for flavor. Go around like this, go around. Don't measure, don't measure. Just go around like this, okay? You can do it. Just like that. Good enough. Seal it. And then, light sodium soy sauce or any kind of soy sauce you have. Just go around. I got to be careful with this because it's a big bottle. Like that, okay? A little more. Okay, that's good. Sesame oil. You can put hot chili or jalapeno or just get the more spice and spicy a little bit. But add hot sesame oil. Okay. Now I want the frying pan hot. Oh, smell good. This is a fusion. And now if you want to add some uh, fajita powder or any kind you have, just more flavor, more spice it up a little bit, you know, you can do that. Look at that. There's a big pot. If you have kids or friends come over, that will be a good recipe to share. Okay, I'm going to stir for a few minutes. I'm going to come back. You have a couple piece of turkey too big, break it apart. Oh, this is good to eat. Very healthy, super healthy, very lean. Okay. Now, we're gonna give a try something like this. Okay? Oh. Very good flavor. Garlicky, bell pepper combined the sweet of the onion. The turkey is nicely cooked tender. Very light in flavor though. Because the soy sauce is very light. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to add some salt, you know? Add some salt. Should be good. So, what I'm going to do is, I have tortilla. You get the idea? That'll be a great, you can make at least a dozen of that, right? If you have kids, friends come over, save some money. You can make four tortilla with this. Ah, oh, yeah? Good. I hope you like the video. I'm sure come. Thank you for watching. I see you next time. Bye.